is Amanda. Welcome to my channel. This is the Throwing Shade Finale for 2017. We will be continuing this at another time, but with all the other projects going on at the beginning of the year, we're just going to put this on hold for a while, bring it back sometime in 2018. So, yeah, and I'm going to do things just a little bit different this time because some of the shadows that I picked out just it just didn't work out so I'm not going to do a tutorial for you but I am going to talk about them and the first thing I want to talk about is Darling Girl Smarties this is one of their spectral shifts and I used it all up I pressed it and as you saw the last update and now there's another shadow in its place by Darling Girl in that same spot but yes, I did end up using this. I use this as a blush topper. It just kind of just gives that blush that you don't necessarily enjoy uh, or doesn't have a lot of pigmentation. It kind of just gives it just a little bit of something, which is nice. Now, the one shade that didn't work for me is this one right here. And this is by Hot Mess Beauty. And it's just, there's no pigmentation to it. I mean, there really isn't. I mean... Whenever you sit there and do that, it's just so much work to build it up and it doesn't even really build up. So it didn't show on the eyes at all. So I am going to actually declutter this. It's really pretty purple, but you know, in the pan. I can't do much else with it. And then the next two comes from the Note Photos Please. And let's see if I can open up. This one right here is called Black Exit, and it is a really pigmented black. I use this, I think, once in my lower lash line. I'm going to be inserting pictures throughout this whole time that I talk about these uh, that I posted on my Instagram. And then, of course, I went ahead and I used some of this purple right here, which was so pretty. In fact, I used it enough to where there is a little bit of a dip there. So, yeah, I really do enjoy this, this shade. This is really, really pretty. I really like this one. And then the final one comes from my Urban Decay Moon Dust Palette. And I have been working on this shade right here, Element. As you can see, um... I'm almost done with this shade. This one certainly lasts a whole lot longer than the other ones that I've cleared out do, so that's nice, but I still do have to use it wet. In fact, I have it in my outer corner today. So, yeah, um, I've used this in multiple ways. I've used this all over the lid. I've used this in the outer corner. Most of the time, until recently, I would put it in my in the middle of my lower lash line, things like that, and... Yeah, I like this shade. It's really, really pretty, but I do experience some fallout. So there is my throwing shade finale. Sorry that I'm not doing a tutorial this time. It's just I feel like because of some crappy shadows and one of them being gone, there was just kind of really no point. So yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give this a thumbs up and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.